Hey, good morning to you. Yeah, oh, Friday mother time. Yeah, oh, weather's improved. It's been a wet all week, hasn't it? Um, I hope you've had a decent week. I am now on my way to Crazy Horse. Yeah, uh, just for a look see. Uh, Stone and Barnes is on tonight, and I was going to go there, but TC's not going. And I reckon, I haven't heard from Banana Man, but I reckon he'll be going to Crazy Horse. Yeah, um, just get my visor down a little bit. Um, I'm obviously, I'm on the Triumph T100. Uh, absolutely wonderful. Uh, reason I'm not doing the mutter tomorrow morning is I've got a hell of a day tomorrow. Uh, I'll be in very early I'm working very early so I wouldn't have time to edit it and get it together uh, which seems to be more and more the case at the moment but um, anyway uh, a few things to discuss um, uh, particularly BSA and Cornish Motorcycle Diaries uh, experience with Thor motorcycles um, always two sides to a story um, but there you go, yeah. Uh, also, Ice Diddy, uh, everybody's uh, been going over and having a look at his channel and subscribing, which I'm really pleased about. Yeah, because he does have some marvellous mutters. Um, and Ian Hughes, of course, uh, he went to the nuclear bunker, I can't remember what it's called now. Um, uh, that video's out. Obviously, we don't see inside it, but it's uh, right out there absolutely marvellous but um, oh, let's get down here <laughs> yeah um, uh, I'll crack on with some photos anyway yeah and straight off my mate Charlie he sent us a couple of photos um, I've got quite a few from him to show but not right now the ones I'm showing tonight is uh, one of his uh, BSA A7 yeah marvellous um, he, he, just, he just loved that bike and yeah he's, got, he's gone and got a scooter instead of his new BSA um, but that's for winter marvellous um, he also sent us a picture of his mate Trevor's matchless look at that first time out for 25 years yeah first time out for 25 years and he's owned it all that time yeah absolutely wonderful uh, also got a photo from um, Steph C yeah uh, absolutely marvellous picture really like this at um, oh, what was it Eshot Airfield yeah marvellous picture uh, that's his NC of course and so uh, one of a micro light and an aeroplane yeah it's turning into tmf absolutely marvelous eh um i'm weighing a 40. A foxy as well he's been out went out with ensworth rider yeah silver fox travels and ensworth riders go out a lot together exploring the yorkshire dales and uh, lancashire and all that lot yeah uh, but this is over um, Nidderdale, Nidderdale uh, in North Yorkshire. Yeah, wonderful. Well, Yorkshire Dales. Let's get down here. Um, what else did I get? Oh, AC. He sent us a picture. He said, "Old oh, Douglas here at uh, uh, what is it, Lewis Cafe uh, down in." Cornwall I think it was yeah absolutely marvellous picture and uh, those NC's uh, such a practical bike with the frunk I know they all seem a little bit weird yeah I didn't trust him one little bit um, yeah marvellous bikes very practical also TCB he sent us a picture um, from 
uh, oh, what was it? Oh, yeah, Digby Wharf Rat Rally. Yeah, and look at this. Could you imagine being in there? And he said, uh, you'll see, the photos will be going through. Yeah, the Globe of Death. Yeah, three bikes in there at one time. Absolutely marvellous. Uh, oh, I, I wouldn't fancy doing it. Uh, but great pictures. Um, then what do I get? Uh, WB sent us a picture of Midnight Star. Look at that. Yeah, that's a Kinderlink, I think. Um, Holland. Yeah, I'm reckoning. Absolutely marvellous. What a beast of a bike to travel on. Just absolutely marvellous. Um, then what did I get? Uh, oh, it was Lee M. Yeah, absolutely marvellous. He, I, I met, I met him and his father. Um, or was it the other way around? Him and his son. Uh, anyway, I met at um, Haywoods, and they were looking at, and they were thinking about buying a Hemi 450. And I said to, they said, what do you think? I said. Oh, it's okay, but it's quite top heavy. I thought that's what that's what I said anyway. Um, but he didn't listen to me. He went and bought it. But now look at this. He sent us this. Uh, there you go, Tame. My new bike, Bullet. He said I didn't listen to you. I should have done. He said you said it was top heavy, and it was. Um, so I've changed it, and I've got a Bullet. Absolutely marvellous. I do like those bullets and I wouldn't mind one and I don't care what Uncle Stu says about them being just the same as the classic 350 don't bother me um, they have some advantages that I like um, such as that big back mud guard but there you go that's just me a question of taste um, Dave B as well he sent us a picture you know Dave he's got that wonderful Norton he sent us a picture of the Norton against the backdrop of the AA box. Do you remember that? But he's also got this 2011 V7. Yeah, absolutely marvellous. Look at that. Um, Complements his Norton quite well, I would say. Absolutely wonderful. Um, yeah, thanks for that, Dave. Really like those pictures. I, I'd quite like another picture of your Norton, if you don't mind. Yeah, <laughs> marvellous. Um, uh, what else did I get? Uh, oh, uh, SQB, yeah, Suffolk Quality Boy, yeah, Nigel. He sent us a picture um, from Copdoc. He'd been at Copdoc and he said, Here you go, a uh, couple of Vela sets for you. A 1966 Thruxton, marvellous, uh, and a 1937 KSS. Yeah, 1937, belting bikes, absolutely wonderful. And do you remember our, we had a video last week, um, complete opposite. Do you remember? So it was the night. Was it a 1927? Um, oh, I uh, can't remember now. How <laughs> absolutely marvellous it was! That little 350 side valve, absolutely wonderful. But anyway. Uh, Warthog, Mark, he sent us, he said, here's a video for you, yeah, it's a uh, MV, look at it, uh, oh, well, I can't, you can't look at it, I haven't put it on, um, it's a uh, MV Augusta from the Grand Prix at, uh, on the Isle of Man, of course, he said, I mean, it's, th it's, uh, thro throttled, yeah, uh, listen, listen to this. Hopefully, that's now gone through. Um, but what a marvellous day. Eh? What a sound. Yeah. Like, can you imagine a lot of them racing round? Oh, it'd just be uh, magical, wouldn't it? Yeah. Um, what else did I get? Uh, oh, 
GE, yeah. Um, he was at Cop Dock, his brother, Darren, Darren Evans, yeah. I think I can say his name. He was at Cop Dock with this, yeah, RS250 Aprilia. Oh, and he won an award. Absolutely marvellous. Uh, best lightweight, uh, I think, in its class, something like that. Uh, can't remember. Absolutely wonderful. Um, also got uh, some pictures from Martin, MM, yeah. Um, Malcop, what is it? Malcop Castle, look at that. Yeah, absolutely marvellous on a, with his hunter yeah those hunters uh, marvellous bikes uh, very light uh, and a bit quicker I think I mean they feel totally different to the classic and the meteor how they've, how they've achieved that I'm not sure but they have and it, the, it's absolutely wonderful now we've got a car there trying to get out of this junction um, oh he's done it so we should all flow through now um, yeah, absolutely cracking bikes, the Hunters. And also, my friend Lisa. Yeah, absolutely wonderful. She sent us... Um, it's actually... Uh, oh, what do you call it? Uh, a gif or a gif. Whatever you want to call them. Yeah, but you'll only get the static photo. Yeah, a giraffe racing absolutely marvellous <coughs> morning old git yeah oh, he's not pleased with me yeah he's, he's just finished watching I did his video that's why <laughs> marvellous uh, oh and uh, morning giraffe yeah what about this giraffe race he says yeah marvellous yeah look at that um, anyway oh, what else did I get uh, DN uh, DN sent us a picture uh, <laughs> um, of a wonderful Norton look at that yeah just like the one at Stonham um, and this wonderful Suzuki race bike absolutely marvellous eh um, but he said his wife he, he was up he went to Alborough that's where the photos come from um, and while he was over there, they then came to Bury, Bury St Edmunds here. Um, and when he came, he drove past the giraffe, and he started talking to the giraffe, and his wife thought he'd gone quite mad. <laughs> Absolutely wonderful. Um, I'm, I'm not going to make these lights, am I? Oh, we might do. Oh no, no, we won't. Yes, we will. Oh, crikey! Indecision. Come on, off you go. Get a scoot on. Oh, just go BMW. Crikey. Um, uh, what else did I get? So that was... Uh, oh, uh, Mike, 5DT. Do you watch that? Marvellous. Did that epic journey on Bobby. Absolutely wonderful. Um, the, the Bobby the Bullet. Absolutely marvellous. Um, well, he's got a couple of videos out of the moment. He's on his way to... Is it Tabot Ness? Yeah, wonderful. Um, he sent us a picture of it en route. Yeah, a uh, picture will be on the video so you can get over and have a look. Absolutely wonderful. Uh, then what? HS. Ha <laughs> ha. Yeah, well, H. He's been telling us, I've got a new bike. I've got a new bike. And I didn't know what it was. He's been waiting for it. He's now got it. Look at that. He's got one of those, them, their gorilla things. Yeah, Royal Enfield Gorilla. Oh, he's going to be zip zapping around on them because I've seen Ian Hughes ride it. <laughs> it definitely goes a little bit. Absolutely marvellous. Um, what else? Uh, oh, Terry C. Yeah. Uh, marvellous picture. Uh, absolutely love it. Uh, uh, Botton in North Yorkshire. Yeah. Uh, of his interceptor. Absolutely wonderful picture. Um, uh, oh, oh. 
let's get round here this video must be clogging on a bit now I don't know what time I started but I'll do one more IT yeah he's uh, down there in Timaru you know Timaru um, in New Zealand and you know IT oh, traffic I hate traffic uh, yeah sorry about that uh, IT uh, it's summer down there so he's rubbing it in but he went out uh, in the morning one degree temperature absolutely marvellous this is on his T100 in green uh, a bit like the gold line but not a gold line um, and he was going to get a radiator guard fitted yeah eight hours eight hours there and back <laughs> can you believe it 420 kilometers uh, that's not that's averaging a pretty good pace that's uh, averaging over uh, 50 kilometers an hour that's not bad it's quite tough to keep that sort of pace up um, but he said it was 18 degrees when he finished um, so there you go yeah absolutely marvelous i'm not going to go on to any more photos and i'm nearly here at crazy horse so i need to get gone so that i can do an introduction to this crazy horse video which you'll probably see um, uh, in winter yeah look have a fantastic weekend forecasts good um, ride safe and look after your loved ones yeah ta-ta